As the authorities established on the first day of April around 11 a.m., they went for a long hike near the clouded jungle that surrounded the Baru volcano. Allegedly, they also took the dog that belonged to the people owning the restaurant where they had brunch. The owners say they started panicking from the thought of what could happen to Kremers and Froon when their dog came back to the restaurant without the girls. At that time, Froon's parents stopped receiving text messages. And this is the last time any of the interrogated people saw them alive. On the morning of the next day, April the 2nd, Froon and Kramer missed their appointment with a local guide, which also scared their families. Unfortunately, the police of Panama were too slow with their work of finding the missing girls.